so hi everyone in this video we will going to automate uh, oracle database login process so generally what we do is we do manual login into database and then we execute uh, queries so in this video we will going to see that how to create a simple shell script using which we can log in and get the output of the queries without actually going inside the database or we can say that without login into the database we can do all the steps on the uh, os console so for that uh, i will create a script Automate.sh then change mod 777 so that all people can execute it. Okay, then let add inside it. So here in the system, we will need to do this. Okay, this will just write now. Here, first we will need enter your query. Let me just enter. Username, okay. Then read username again. Enter password. Okay. Enter password. Then read password. Then echo. Then enter host. Enter host. Then read host. Then you go enter port port number okay and read port and finally what we do enter service or say SID service or SID so can instance or you can say instance these are the parameters which we required to automate the shell script token or SID. Let me add here and then read service or SID. Then, then I am the last. Enter your SQL. So these are the input parameters and now we will see that how we are going to execute it. So first of all we need to mention SQL plus then username, then password, then add symbol here. Uh, then we need a host, then column, then here yeah, we need a port, then slash. Again, at the last, we will need service or say side. Okay, so these are the all what we need. We're done. Then we will use the end of the file operator and we will give output to uh, script which is output.txt. So this script will hold all the output from this uh, of this query. Okay, so we can see. And view this output file for getting the result of this file. So now here we need to set line size 400. Then here we need to mention our coins. Okay. And at the last we need to mention exit. Then here we will mention end of the file. Okay. So this has been done for getting the output. Output of output dot txt file. We can simply do cat to the output dot txt file. Okay. Then we can save it. Okay. So first of all, let me now we're gonna execute it. Okay, enter username, Scott, enter password, Scott, enter host PM, enter code, which is 1521. Then enter service or SI. Then enter your SQL query. So here in this we will mention our SQL query. Instance name okay. B dollar. And now here we need to mention a power slash. Okay. And here we will mention view uh, name, which is instance. that's it. So you can see that we are getting the output on the OS console without actual login to the database. So in this way we can create an automate uh, automated SQL 